next time. I did get a sneak hint though that it was only okay. I'm really hoping I do not get the same box my friend did then. <laughs> I have been waiting for one of these to be, like, reconfirm my love for it because I do love work drugs. It's the only subscription that I am involved in that will let you do reviews for points towards money in the shop. So that's why I like it because basically every box you get $5 towards the Birch Box shop, which they have a ton of, like, name brand stuff. It's, it's all name brand, but it's... Yeah, they just have a ton of really good things. So, it feels heavy, and I think that is a good thing. I wouldn't see why it wouldn't be. Maybe there's a full-size product in here. We'll see. I have not opened it, obviously. I have to wait for you guys. It's fun when you get, like, first impressions of it. We will find out, though. I'm going to go ahead and open it. Oops. I'm not very good with scissors. I so stabbed myself there. Always. I'm not good with this. Why do I always cut it? I don't do anything with it, though. But if I didn't do that, maybe I would. Probably not. I can use these, or I do, should. I should save these for Christmas. Nah, I'm already a hoarder enough. I don't need to be saving any more stuff. I'll recycle it. March Magnet. I'm going to let you guys see the brands I'm getting before I do. I guess I could read this, but I really don't feel like it. Okay, the first thing I see, sorry I didn't show you guys, just this. There's some coupon -y thing, and this is for Fake Up. It says, Fake Up Hydrating Concealer is your little secret, proven to keep skin hydrated for up to six hours. I've been wanting this really bad because my friend was talking about it, and it just seems really cool because it's not supposed to crease on you. Which I always crease because I like to put it like under my eyes, but that's the spot where I crease. That and my laugh lines, if any of you have that problem too, I get like, not wrinkles, although technically, would that be considered a wrinkle? I mean, it's just from smiling too much and I'm not going to stop smiling all the time just because it creates, like creases there. But my makeup will settle in the line, so. Even when I don't have makeup on though, if I'm smiling a lot, which is all the time, I will get the little creases there in my skin, like a wrinkle. Is it a, it must be a wrinkle then. Um, I don't know, I've had them since I was like 12, I don't know. Um, what was I even talking about? Anyways, this is a special bonus offer. We are welcoming Fake Up Hydrating Concealer to our roster of beauty must-haves with an exclusive bonus shop offer. Get a free Bad Gal Lash Deluxe Sample with any benefit purchase or when you spend $25 or more at Birchbox.com. And is there a coupon code? Yes, BB Hearts Benefit. And I will have that link down for you. All coupons will be in the about section in case you want to see it yourself. Though there it is. And the fake up's $24. It's time to open this. Doesn't look bad to me. That looks pretty cool. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and pull this out first then. It says Serge Normant <laughs> Meta Revive Volumizing Dry Shampoo. I love dry shampoo. How'd they know? That's no, it's not being lazy, it's just being healthy for your hair. I wash my hair every other day, but my hair gets greasy fast. So within the first like 12 to 24 hours, my hair is fine. But after that, it gets a little greasy. So I use the teas on my hair, but I'm excited to try this out. And it's with cedar bark, so it must smell good. Oh, this does smell really good. It's kind of like smelling a candle. And God knows I like my hair to smell like candles. Actually, I would not mind that at all. I really hope this feels good in my hair because this could be like a holy grail product for me. It smells so good. I, I wish I could let you smell it. I'm so tired. <laughs> oh, oh God. Oh, kitty. Sometimes, if you look, Chester, like, 
not like a surprise, but if you just stare him in the eye for like a second or two, he'll do this. Like, I don't even know. He does not meow, so he does other noises, like I guess his version of meow, but that's not because he'll do like he'll make that noise and no sound will come out. You can just hear his like jaw and mouth opening and he'll like lunge at you just a second. I don't know. Tell me if your cat does that because my cat, my older cat and my other cats at home <laughs> never did that and it scares me because I think he's about to like attack me but he doesn't. <laughs> you got a mini version, but that's what he does, except normally it's a little more. He was a little confused because I had a camera stand and a camera pointing at him, but you get the point of it. Oh, P.S. If you haven't noticed over there, I have like all my nail polishes out because I was trying to... I had them all in a box and I was trying to see what colors I have because I've been noticing I've been buying some of the same colors. And that is not good when I don't remember what colors that I already have. So, I have them out. I need to buy a rack, like an acrylic nail polish rack. If you know where to get one that's semi-cheap because I am a poor college student, I would really appreciate that. We're going to go ahead and move on with the box. So now that I've been sidetracked like five times. The next thing is Wish Shave Cream in the scent Blueberry. And let's go ahead and smell this. Oh, it smells good. It's blueberry fruity scent. I don't use shaving cream just because I have the Venus Breeze, which has the um, shaving cream around it, and it's so good. If you've never tried Venus, pretty much all the razors are good, but Venus Breeze is my favorite. Any of the actually any of the ones that have the shaving cream around it because it's so moisturizing you don't need shaving cream but when they sometimes they fall off before their time to go and when that happens I can see myself trying this out I like that they're giving bigger samples if you didn't notice I mean this is a really good size that's like travel size this is travel size too oh this is adorable on the card it said they were giving a special treat by Madewell and it is this nail file and it has just floral details on it and it says Madewell for Birch Box. Now I have a strange phobia of nail files. I hate them. I hate the noise they make. They just make me cringe and want to cry. So I'm going to keep it in the packaging and probably give it away in a giveaway or to one of my friends because it's adorable and I don't want to throw it away because normally I would throw it right away. <gasps> oh, that's cool. Full size. Finally got one. It's by Coco. I think they have these at like Target and whatnot. CVS places that I've gotten them from someone else before. They're nail polish. Uh, what do you call that? Nail polish thingies? I don't know. The print is actually cute. It's just blue, darker blue, and light blue, which in sign language, this is blue, and this is bright blue. That's pretty cool. I'm learning colors this week. And it lasts up to 14 days. And actually, you need a nail file with these things. They normally come with it. I'm sure this does, but that's actually a nice pair to give with each other. That's pretty cool. And now on to the last... Thing or things. I don't know what my friend got because I already love this box. Pull this out. Okay, into the packets. Caldria Aromatherapeutic Body Lotion and number three coconut fig leaf. The packaging feels really good, actually. I know that's weird, but it does. Nice. I will definitely use this. I use lotion all the time. It's like one of the things that you can't get enough of. Oh, and then I have the same thing, but in tea, olive, lime. And another of the same, an aloe water apricot. All the packaging is cute. When I saw that fake up or the benefit thing in general, I was thinking in my mind, like, how cool would it be 
if we would have got a benefit product in this. Because I don't know about you guys, but I remember getting full size tart lip balm things. What do you call them? Lip balm sticks? It's in my mind, I can't think of it. But I remember getting a full size one of those once or twice. I feel like I actually had two. And I loved them. And so I know they have it in them to give us something really cool like that one of these times. I'm just waiting for it. But I am still happy with what I got because this is my favorite thing. Definitely my favorite. Um, dry shampoo. I'm just going to do an overview. Of course, I had the three body lotion packs and the nail things. This is my second favorite. And there's something else in there. There's this. Oh, yeah. The body shaving cream. So, I'm satisfied. The last couple of months I haven't been, but this is good. I would have paid $10 for all this, definitely. So, let me know what you got. If you got something else, I know Birchbox will switch it up a lot with different subscribers, so I'm sure a lot of you got different things. And if anyone got Benefit products, let me know. Maybe. I'll be jealous, but I, I still want to know that because that'd be pretty cool for you guys. And I guess I will just see you guys really soon in another video. Bye!